yourself a question. Are you the type of person that panics under pressure or finds pleasure in the pressure? What's going on? We back from that issue to be you got on the inside. We just got to get it out. I'm pumped up. I'm excited because I believe that today is your day. It's hump day and you can get over the hump, but you got to believe it before you achieve it. You got to say it, believe it, and do it. So I want to tell you a quick story. I'm going to use my embarrassment to be your enlightenment. I was in an underground cave and we were snorkeling. And I, lo I love when I get in the water. I love going down deep under the water and being able to swim under the water. Well, there was one problem today. I had on a snorkel. And I didn't think about the fact that I had on a snorkel. So I went under the water. Water, all the water came in through the snorkel to snorkel and I began to drink the water and as I began to drink the water I began to swallow it and if you can imagine when you begin to swallow water it's very difficult to breathe and when you can't breathe sometimes you panic and so it's I, I, so here's exactly what happened when I began to drink the water I began to have trouble breathing and then at that point in time, when I panicked, I forgot that I knew how to swim. And so here I am in an underground cave, panicking, beginning to drown because I had done something I had never done before. So I'm trying to tell you today, just because you're in a negative environment does not mean that you will have to allow that negative environment to get in you. I'm gonna say it again, I want you to catch it. Just because you're in a negative environment does not mean you allow the negative environment to get in you. Because when a negative environment gets in you, it can change you and the environment will begin to drown you. Don't allow the environment to drown you. You put the positive into the negative environment, not the negative into you. So three things I want you to do. I want you to stay by the guide. That's right, we had a guide under the cave, but I got away from the guide because I knew I could swim. And when I got away from the guide, I began to drown when a negative environment, when the water got inside, inside me, I had to go find a guide. The guide had to come to me, as a matter of fact, because when I began to panic, I could not find a guide. Number two, don't panic. That's right. People don't drown because they can't swim. I know how to swim, but I felt like I was drowning because I began to panic. And when I began to panic, I lost all my thoughts. I lost all my reasons. So when you go through trials, when you go through tribulations, don't panic. Stay calm and just trust the process. Trust the journey. Because when you do that, you will have your victory. And then lastly, number three, just wait. Just wait. Whatever you're going through, whatever's happening, just wait and it will pass. It will pass. Stay close to the guy who's guiding you through your trials and tribulations. <laughs> Stay close to the guy. Don't panic and just wait. Be patient and this too shall pass. You got the strength to be on the inside. Let's get it out.